This is the ghetto. my hair looks crazy but I have to put it up so I can do my makeup um, if you're new here make sure you subscribe give this video a huge thumbs up and today I'm showing you my current faves but hopefully you don't think my taste is weird um, leave a comment down below of you know what you find useful from this video if you do any of the tricks and tips that I do um, I don't think my makeup is very complicated but yeah hop right into the video period poo <laughs> I want to show you the products I'm using. They're also going to be, everything's going to be linked in the description below. Oh my god. <laughs> so I do use the Neutrogena um, Foundation Healthy Skin in the color Chestnut 135. I used to use, I still do use Maybelline, um, but the, the Maybelline I have to mix different colors to get my shade. I feel like this one's more fitted to my skin. So what I do is I take a little brush and I dip it in there. Um, just because you know it doesn't have a pump so I, I get a brush and I put the foundation in the spots where I have the most issues I'm looking over there because my mirror is right there alright I'm gonna go ahead and add a little I can't have this too loud because copyright. And I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit more. Sometimes it looks a little bit too like skin that it doesn't it doesn't provide heavy coverage. It's just like really light. But as I said, my skin's been breaking out, so especially on my forehead. I'm gonna add one more layer. See how like skin how skin like it looks? It doesn't look cakey or anything. It actually makes you glow. Wow. <laughs> I really like this foundation, y'all look. I look like I'm not wearing anything. It just makes you pop. <laughs> like seriously. I mean you can see I'm breaking out, but look at the skin. Period. This is the ghetto, but I use Fit Me by Maybelline, of course. I always talk about them um, I like to I never used to bake or like do anything to my under eyes but I started doing this recently and I've noticed a change a powder and add it to my brush carefully do this because this is way way lighter than my skin and I don't want to put it everywhere on my face you know so we're gonna just tap right on the on the side of the nose and all the way to this. Oh my god, come on. And here, like so. Just tap, 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 tap. Alright, and you want to do the same thing to the other side. After I do that, I try to blend, blend my brush and <laughs> my brush, my blush. You know, oh my gosh! Like, have you ever been like the person that puts the L or the R is like blush? You say brush, or rice? You say lice. <laughs> I feel like only Africans do that, but I'm African, so I can beat it. So I use this is my favorite palette, um, um, Zulu by Juvia's Place. I always use this palette for everything. Um, as you can see, some of the colors are totally gone. I need to buy another one. But I use this pink shade over here and put it on my cheeks. Truth be told, I used to hate doing blush. I hated blush. I used to think girls that did blush, especially black girls that did blush, was so weird. But now I love blush. So what you want to do is you want to smile because you want to put it on your cheeks. So I smile. 
Hey, okay, so I smile like that, and then you're gonna put it right there, right there. I know right now it looks <laughs> clown. I look like a clown, but it's okay. So you're gonna put it right there, and you wanna blend it. I always take it higher into my face, and I just blend everything together um, like that. Now the goal is not to make it look so pink. Oh my gosh, it looks really pink. <laughs> oh, okay. And I just put color everywhere on my face because I feel like the Maybelline that I added on there was a little bit too much. Actually, no, it's not. <laughs> oh yeah, this is exactly how I do my makeup. And then if I feel like I need a little bit more lightening, I go ahead and just use the brush without powder because I know it has excess on there. Now keep in mind, I don't contour, I just use powder. I don't contour yet, because I'm not good at it yet. Girl, are you ever gonna do your eyebrows? I'm getting to it, I'm getting to it. I used to do eyebrows first, but I realized that mm, that didn't really work for me. So I started doing foundation first, like my face first, and then the eyes, and then I see me now, she. It's gonna make sense later. Boom, oh my God. Okay, so what I do, Every time, all the time, if you've been watching me for a while, you've noticed that this is my every bent makeup look. This is the palette that I use. This is from, don't judge me, <laughs> but my palette is really stained. It's stained with makeup, but it's by BC. And then the name of the palette is Live Beautifully. I literally got this from TJ Maxx. Um, so I use this gold color, this one. Y'all, look, it's very, it's very rich. Look, look at that. <laughs> so I use this for my under eyes because I like to look like, you know, cry gold tears because I do, because my store is that rich. <laughs> so you want to take it, oh my God, and just put it under your eye. And try not to talk when doing this. I find that when I talk, when I do certain things, it looks bad. So now for highlight on my nose, as you've noticed, I literally haven't put anything on my nose. I just try to like highlight where you see like natural light already there. I'm gonna take the same palette. I use palette for my nose highlight, I know. I used to use the gold one, but I don't use gold, I use this what is this copper it's not copper it's like a brown ish color this was i don't know if you can see this was the gold one that's under my eyes and this is the one oh my god that's the one i used to highlight it's very like skin like take it put it where i already see the natural highlight okay so it's on my bridge as well so it's like we're just really highlighting what's already there Use my finger. Mm -hmm. Ash, please <laughs> go away. This is the Fenty Beauty oh. the highlighter, and this is there's ginger, ginger, ginger binge and ma Moscow Mule. <laughs> Moscow Mule. I'm gonna be using the Moscow Mule is the one that I use because it's more sparkly and like highlighty. So I just take this uh, brush that I use for my um, blush. It's, oh my gosh, brush that I use for my blush. That's a tongue twister. All right, so then I just add it right here on my cheek like that. Oh, you see, you see it though. You see, you see it. All right, and then you want to do the side as well. Okay, now look, look, when the sun hits the skin, I'm telling you it's gonna be popping. I did this look the other day and my photos came out so beautiful in the sun. By the way, follow me on Instagram at I am Tiange. Get me to 10K on there. Oh, we're so close, we're so close. Um, and I'm super grateful for everything. I love all you guys. I love all you guys on here on my YouTube. I love everybody on my Instagram. Thank you for supporting me. 
Oh my god. I love it. I neglect them. Now my eyebrows are very thin. I used to have thicker brows, but I just feel like thinner ones look better on me and they're easier to manage. Honestly, you don't need to do you don't need to, to fill in too much. You know what I'm saying? You just follow the shape. The, the brow pencil I'm using the the color the label is washed off. <laughs> so we just go just fill them in. I mean, just follow the shape, which at this point is basically a straight line. I started doing my own brows. I stopped going to the ladies because um, when I say make them thin, they'll make them disappear. Like, no, like. The next thing is eyeliner. Eyeliner, and this one is from Maybelline as well. I love this eyeliner so much. So if your eyes are hooded like mine and you want a detailed eyeliner tutorial, let me know. Because I'm gonna go ahead and do this because it takes me time. I have to like be quiet. <laughs> Hold on, I'll be right back. Oh my god. Okay, so I did my eyeliner. It's not nothing crazy, it's just regular schmegla. So, lips. I'm gonna line my lips. Alright. Went to go look for my lip gloss, couldn't find it. Um, my lips are lined. If you can tell they are. Nigerian auntie, what's up? <laughs> I feel like all African aunties used to have their lips like this and I used to laugh. Now look at me. Doing the same thing. Okay. Anyway, I'm just gonna use Vaseline for now because I'm not about to look for it. If I have like a really big pimple, I'll make it a beauty mark. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's just a mark for now that's going to disappear. So let's see if I have any major pimples. Right here, super cute mascara. And honestly, oh, this mascara is also by BG, the same company that made this um, beauty concepts. Yeah. So, the last but not least is the hair, of course. Of course. Um, I use, this is totally unnecessary, but I'm gonna show you anyway. My scalp is very dry right now. With makeup. And this is the look, guys. That's the look. Thank you so much for watching this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm asking nicely. If you made it this far, you might as well subscribe. Period. Because clearly you like what you see, and you know, I like what I see, and I like you. So let's get to know each other. Let's follow me on Instagram, and I am Tiangi. Comment down below your thoughts about this video. So, with that being said, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.